did it before, changed the way the world uses computers with the concept of dispersed data processing. A simple idea, really, but one whose time had come because companies with investments in big central computers were running into problems. Their big computers kept getting bogged down by the load, thousands and thousands of tasks daily, until data points showed how a force of smaller, decentralized computers could handle a lot of that load. Located in functionally dispersed parts of the business, where data processing demands originate, data point computers got more work done without adding to the mainframe load. Since then, dispersed data processing has saved millions of dollars by reducing computer costs and improving business operating efficiency. But business data processing can still bog down as a result of the conventional way of building computers. Dispersed computer or centralized mainframe, any conventional computer has limits to its capacity to do work or to grow. Trying to make do with one overworked computer puts all of the business eggs in one basket. If that computer fails, the entire data processing operation grinds to a halt. Replacing an overloaded computer with a bigger one is often quite expensive. Upgrading to a larger machine means that until workload catches up with it, valuable capital is tied up in a costly, underused computer. Adding a second computer to share the work may solve one problem, but create another. Because splitting in two the store of information, the database they must hold in common, leads to more overhead in duplicating files maintained by both computers. And again, a limit is quickly reached, and you are stuck. Is there a solution to this dilemma? A modular architecture that allows for incremental growth at predictable costs? Using equipment that won't become obsolete with each new model announced? A system that allows many users to perform many different tasks without wasteful duplication of the database? DataPoint presents the solution. Another idea whose time has come. A simple way to rival the power of even the biggest computers without their disadvantages. Based on the idea that the way to obtain X amount of computer power is with X number of computers. Not bigger computers, but small computers working together as never before. Relying not on special new machines, but on the proven advanced business processors DataPoint customers have used for years. This innovative concept is called attached processing, and its realization is called the attached resource computer, ARC. ARC, comprised of as many resource units, or as few, as a business may need, in an endless number of possible configurations, because ARC's growth and shape are determined by each company's own functional requirements, not by conventional computer system architecture. How can ARC solve all of these problems? Conventional computer systems make the central processor fulfill at the same time the basic system functions of applications program execution, disk file maintenance and retrieval, and the organization of internal communications, with the result that it does all of them more slowly. But ARC distributes these basic functions. It lets them be handled by specialists. The Applications Processor, workhorse of the attached resource computer, doing the actual data processing that is the whole reason for computers in the first place. Freed from time-consuming data storage and retrieval chores, it can now operate at record speeds to get more work done. The File Processor, manager and master of the ARC database, responsible for handling requests for data stored in its disk units. Because this is its only function, it locates and delivers remotely stored data to other processors as fast or faster than they can get it from their local disks. All of ARC's processors are attached to the Interprocessor Bus, a sophisticated short-range electronic pathway that communicates data at extremely high speed. It's like having all of the other attached resources inside your own local processor for every user of the ARC system. As many applications processors can be attached to the ARC system as there are types of work to do. Online transaction processing with data share. Batch processing with COBOL. Communications to other computer systems with networking software. 
Even a company's central mainframe can participate in the ARC system as an applications processor through data points, direct channel interface options, all at the same time. And more than one file processor can be put to work. With each new file processor, ARC's data handling speed increases. And so does its capacity. Users need not even know the physical location of the remotely stored information they share. ARC remembers where everything is in the collective database. What happens if one attached component fails? Suppose a file processor quits. Simply replace it with another processor from the system, and that becomes a file processor, with no system reprogramming needed. Data processing operations can be continuous, because now there are lots of baskets to put those eggs in. What if just one more workstation is needed for computer program development? An economical attached processor is the answer, designed especially for the ARC system. It utilizes the common database of the file processors, combining the convenience of a terminal with the power of a small computer. Suppose increased business transactions create a need for 10 more workstations. Just attach a data share applications processor, and up to 24 video display terminals can be added to the ARC system. If security is a worry, attached processing holds the key. Information in the database can be restricted in several different ways. And if need be, each application's processor can have its own private files that only it can use. These changes require no operating system conversions, no reprogramming, no retraining. Because processors attached to an ARC system continue to work the same as before, no matter how big the ARC gets. And if data point computer systems are already at work for your company, you can make the transition to ARC with existing advanced business processors. And every program you now use will run the same on ARC, only better. Modular processing resources for virtually unlimited power. Data storage economically expandable to unheard of amounts. Higher operating speeds than ever before. Complete transparency to users of data handling and communications. There's never been a computer system like this. Until now. Until ARC. Attached processing. An idea that will change the way the world uses computers. The ARC system. From data point.